Hello and welcome to the Investing Iguana, the channel that helps you master the Singapore stock market and achieve your financial freedom. Do you want to know how the stock market can change your life for the better? Do you want to learn some secrets and tips that most Singaporeans don't know about investing? If you answered yes, then this video is for you. In this video, we will reveal 10 facts about the stock market that will blow your mind and make you a smarter investor. The Singapore stock market is an enigma to many locals, often seen as the playground for the wealthy or a risky venture for the uninformed. However, investing in the stock market can be a game changer for personal finance, retirement planning, and overall wealth building in Singapore. With the integration of investment options through CPF and SRS, even the ordinary Singaporean can benefit from knowing how the stock market functions. This video explores 10 facts about the stock market that you probably didn't know but should if you're serious about building a secure financial future in Singapore. 1. Stock Market and CPF, an unlikely pair Most Singaporeans are familiar with the Central Provident Fund, CPF, as a compulsory savings scheme for retirement. What they might not realize is that CPF can be integrated into their stock market investments through the CPF Investment Scheme, CPFIS. The scheme allows you to invest a portion of your CPF Ordinary Account, OA, and Special Account, SA, and a range of investment products, including stocks. This is a strategic move that can offer the potential for higher returns compared to the traditional CPF interest rates, but it does come with increased risk and should be approached cautiously. 2. SRS, a hidden gem for stock investors. The Supplementary Retirement Scheme, SRS, is often overshadowed by CPF, but is equally important for the smart Singaporean investor. SRS is a voluntary savings scheme that offers tax incentives. What makes it even more intriguing is that SRS funds can be used to invest in stocks, bonds, and unit trusts. This not only provides a tax-efficient way to invest, but also diversifies your investment options, potentially elevating your retirement savings to the next level. 3. Dividends aren't just extra cash. Dividends are often viewed as a nice bonus or extra income from stock investments. However, dividends serve a crucial role in wealth building, especially for long-term investors. When reinvested, dividends can exponentially increase your investment through the magic of compounding. In Singapore, with its thriving market of dividend-paying stocks, understanding the significance of dividends and incorporating them into your investment strategy can be a savvy move. 4. Investing in Singapore Treasury Bills Singapore Treasury Bills are government-backed, short-term securities that offer a low-risk investment option. While these are not directly related to the stock market, they can be a part of a diversified portfolio. Investors looking to safeguard some of their capital while venturing into the stock market might find Treasury Bills an attractive option. They offer a guaranteed return and are an excellent short-term parking space for funds, especially when the stock market is volatile. 5. Leveraging REITs for Property Exposure Real estate investment trusts, REITs, are a significant part of the Singapore stock market. They allow investors to gain exposure to property assets without actually buying physical property. REITs often offer higher dividend yields than other types of stocks and can be a great way to diversify your investment portfolio. In a property-focused economy like Singapore, understanding REITs and how to invest in them can offer a strategic advantage in your investment journey. 6. Dollar Cost Averaging, Slow and Steady Dollar Cost Averaging, DCA, is an investment strategy where you consistently invest a fixed sum of money into the stock market, regardless of its performance. This method effectively minimizes the impact of market volatility and reduces the emotional factors that often lead to poor investment decisions. In Singapore, where investment options are diverse, adopting a DCA strategy can help you build a robust portfolio over time. 7. Risk Management – More Than Just Diversification Risk management is a term often thrown around in investment circles, but not deeply understood. Beyond diversifying your portfolio, risk management includes setting stop-loss orders, understanding your risk tolerance, and continually educating yourself about market trends and investment products. 
In a market as dynamic as Singapore's, effective risk management can be the difference between a profitable portfolio and financial ruin. 8. Taxes and the Singaporean Investor The Singapore tax structure offers various benefits to investors, such as the absence of capital gains tax. Understanding the tax implications can significantly impact your net returns. However, certain taxes like the withholding tax on foreign dividends should be accounted for. Being aware of these can help you make informed decisions, especially when you are diversifying internationally. 9. Market Cycles and Timing While it's practically impossible to time the market perfectly, understanding market cycles can provide insights into when it might be a good time to buy or sell. Economic indicators, market sentiment, and political stability are all factors that influence market cycles. Being attuned to these can give you a leg up in your investment journey, especially in a market as interconnected and vibrant as Singapore's. 10. The Psychological Aspect of Investing Investing isn't just about numbers and market trends, it's also an emotional journey. Cognitive biases like overconfidence, herd mentality, and loss aversion can severely affect your investment decisions. Being aware of these psychological factors and developing strategies to mitigate them is crucial for long-term success. Even experienced investors in Singapore can fall prey to these biases, which is why continuous self-education and emotional discipline are essential. The Singapore stock market is a multifaceted environment that offers a plethora of investment opportunities for those who are willing to take the time to understand it. From leveraging your CPF and SRS accounts to understanding the subtleties of dividends and market cycles, there is a wealth of information available to those who seek it. The key to successful investing in Singapore lies in continuous learning, effective risk management, and a disciplined approach. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. It really helps us to understand what kind of content you want to see more of. And don't forget to subscribe. Here at The Investing Iguana, we're dedicated to helping you navigate your financial journey with confidence and clarity. And guess what? There's plenty more where this came from. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos, where we'll tackle other interesting financial topics like the best investment strategies, understanding the stock market, and how to make your money work harder for you. As always, we're thrilled to have you as part of our Investing Iguana community. Your support helps us keep producing free content like this. Remember, every like, share, and subscribe goes a long way. Thanks for joining us today. Keep investing, keep growing, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.